Hello, welcome back. This is going to be my second video for the ZOHD Talon 250G. In previous video, I already did an unboxing. So in this video, it's going to be a build video where I install the flight controller and also the FPV system, the GPS and stuff. As I mentioned in my previous video, I did not receive any printed manuals inside the box. Only these two catalog. And I did do some search online and managed to find the manual. So I'll put it in the link below. Apparently there is a recommended takeoff weight for this aircraft, which is 240 to 320 gram. So we have to be very careful with which parts and electronics we are going to add. Since the empty aircraft itself already weighed 113 gram, these are the parts that I'm going to use with the Talon 250G build. For flight controller, I'm using this Matek F722 wing. This is uh, the video transmitter, Rush FPV Solo. Camera is a Cadex N. Uh, receiver is Crossfire Nano and lastly the GPS is BN180 this is the compartment inside the fuel sludge it is quite big you can put your flight controller and stuff inside here so this is my flight controller the center of gravity is just under this uh, wood but if you want to put like at the back uh, I'm not sure if you can see or not in this in the video there's a slope going down in this area so you have to get creative if you want to place the flight controller behind finally done with the wiring on the flight controller I decided to change the connector using this micro connector instead of the original one. It took me one whole day to finish cutting the wires and crimping all the connectors. And it might be overkill to use F722 wing for 4 channel aircraft. But I plan to use more than that. Three of these will be used for control surfaces, the ailerons and the tail. And then these two for future future project. Maybe I add second camera with pen and tail since this board support two cameras. I did not wire the ESC and motor directly to the board. Since I'm planning to upgrade the ESC and motor later, and I want to keep the the current ESC as it is. This is the video transmitter. I already make my own connector. I can pull as long as I want, so there's going to be no issue to place it on the wing. I carve up carve up some part of the wing to insert the video transmitter and then the wire goes directly below and together with the servo wire also using this uh, micro connector for radio control I use this crossfire micro crossfire nano sorry the antenna is pushed uh, through the the wing it is tight fit no glue or tape or anything and also the GPS, I place it just under the wing. I think the styrofoam will not block the GPS signal. It should be okay. I already glued the tail. I'm using this UHU, expanded polystyrene glue. Here is the whole thing fully assembled. Every single component is detachable. The weight of the aircraft including flight controller 
FPV system and GPS is 171 gram so you have around 80 more gram for battery if you want to go sub 250 but according to the manuals you can go up to 320 grams so you can use larger battery if you want or add another component like second camera or something shouldn't be a problem now that all of this thing is ready all i need to do is just plug this thing to my computer and do some configuration in INF then we should start be able to fly here we are finally finished with INF setting took me another day since I couldn't get the crossfire to work after a lot of troubleshooting now it's finally working so all the control surfaces is working now the FPV system should be working also yeah, so everything is working even the GPS unit also is working and I try to arm So the motor, everything also working fine. And also I assign a switch to control the VTX power. I'm not sure if you can see or not. Okay, change to second level, third level, and also the last one. I also program uh, altitude hold and also uh, return to home so everything should be working fine but sadly I couldn't fly this Talon 250G yet because it is raining outside so see you in the next video bye bye